quarantine bag. Not even letting it into the house. I told my dad if anything shows up, just leave it. Left in a stack of disposable gloves. To me, toys, man, I'm so glad. This is awesome. To me, toys, six inch army man figures. Oh, that's the way we're going. We'll take a closer look at them some other time and break out the Loctite gel control for our bayonet. Yeah, three of my favorite army man figures ever. Especially this guy. Look at look at the detail on his face. Huh. Stampage on the bottom. How about that? Interesting. Forego the usual procedure. Handle the package as little as possible. Both of these uh, vendors did everything right, by the way. Congratulations. And here's. I'm sorry. Plastic Craft. Spaceman. Ash, can you see this? Looks like the base may have been repaired, but I don't care. It's my first example of the plastic craft space form. Flashing's a little, a little thick. I'll have to do some comparisons, but that's a cool guy. Right on. We're done. Got so worked up over those to me guys that I sort of skipped over the uh, plastic craft derived guy. And I say derived because he's a soft plastic, army man type PVC plastic. And plastic craft used a stiff, hard, brittle plastic. So he's not. He looks at the, the, the detailing. My light's kind of off here, but the detailing is, is nice and crisp, so I'm pretty sure he was made from an original mold. And I know that there was a series that came out of Spain with uh, fitted helmets, and that sort of looks like it could be a helmet collar there. I'm not familiar enough with the uh, Plastic Craft line to know how they're... I don't have any other examples of it to compare with, so other than online pictures. Uh, so he's an unknown. He, it's definitely, I don't think it's plastic craft, and, and it looks like the base at some point may have been repaired. And that's that's cool, you know, for what I paid for him. He can be what he is, and if it is one of the line from Spain, they're probably even more scarce than the uh, plastic craft originals. And here's a little setup. This is my ogle shelf. I'll get some random things out here. Uh, thinking about doing a setup with the Tom Corbett's in front of the Tom Corbett thing and using the jungle pyramid and making some art. Anyway. Miles and miles and miles.